class uh, that I'd like to talk about is the Hypersonic uh, Aerodynamics for Flight Testers course. And this is a course we've taught now for five years. Uh, it's meant to uh, educate engineers and program managers, uh, other practitioners in the flight test field, actually those who just want to know more about hypersonics. And uh, it covers the entire gamut, uh, not just hypersonics, but aero thermodynamics, flight dynamics, uh, course flight testing, and in all aspects of the hypersonic flight regime. Which One aspect of the class that's uh, really an earmark of all my classes is that we go fairly heavily into uh, aviation history and look at the things that have been done before. It's uh, amazing how many people are unaware of what was done 40 years ago, uh, even 50 years ago. And because of that, it's a great revelation to them and it helps them be better engineers and do things right uh, in today's environment that requires you to do faster, better, cheaper. Well, when one finishes that class, uh, one can have, certainly have an appreciation of the multidisciplinary aspects of hypersonics. It's not just aerodynamics, but you need to be concerned about the heating on the vehicle most especially, uh, the propulsion characteristics of the vehicle, uh, how to analyze flight test data, how to acquire uh, flight test data like pressures, temperatures, accelerations, strains on the airframe, uh, how to acquire those data, how to analyze those data. Uh, so from that standpoint, it's something that's very practical and I have a tremendous love of flight. Uh, I, even as a child, I knew that I'd be basically an engineer and uh, have really spent a lifetime learning. I try to apply those particular lessons uh, and help the coming generation where there's a, a great chasm between those that are entering the field and those that are leaving the field. And as one that's kind of uh, on the other, on that other end, uh, I'd like to help transfer that knowledge. I have a great passion for, for flight, for, for knowledge. I've been very successful in my career uh, as well as teaching. I've taught now for over 20 years and it's a thing that I enjoy probably the very most. It's enjoyable to see others learn, see that light of understanding appear in their face, uh, for them to capture the vision of what flight is all about and to continue the, the quest. Uh, that is, uh, in the words of the motto of Edwards Air Force Base, odd inexplorata, towards the unknown.